Desk brought to you live from Tehran. I'm Zarin Chajari. Thanks for watching. Now, millions of Iranians have flooded the streets across the country to celebrate the 29th year of the Islamic Revolution. People took to the streets since the early hours of the morning to mark the country's greatest national event in cities all over the country. More than 600 Iranian and foreign reporters covered the event in the capital Tehran, where up to seven routes had been prepared for the rallies. Demonstrators chanted national slogans, including calls for the recognition of the right to nuclear technology. Similar rallies were held throughout the country. Still in Tehran, President Mahmoud Ahmadinejad said his country considers its nuclear case closed and the world has affirmed Iran's right to nuclear technology. Addressing crowds in Tehran's Azadi Square, Ahmadinejad said Iran achieved its right through resistance. He said major powers have tarnished the reputation of the UN Security Council for unjustly punishing Iran. Ahmadinejad said reports by the UN Nuclear Agency and the US intelligence services have proven that Western accusations were baseless criticized those powers that urged the UN to pursue its mistaken policies against Iran. The president said they should apologize to Iran and realize that it will not retreat in the face of threats and pressure. Ahmadinejad said Iranians will always oppose injustice because the Islamic Revolution is all about defending those that are oppressed. Now after